Welcome to Zero Page Homebrew, your best source for the newest Atari games after dark. Yeah. This is where we put in some high scores, try and complete some games, but today we're going to be competing in the high score contest mm -hmm. for Last Strike DX from Reboot Games. Very exciting. And it's been underway for a few pretty, weeks now. Pretty fun game, so it's I'm looking fun, forward to yes. it. I don't think I'm going to be very high up on that list, but I it is a really fun game to play. So. Yes, at worst we'll have fun. Exactly. <laughs> horrible. What a horrible way uh, to spend a Sunday night, uh, you know? Terrible. Like, mm, yeah. Welcome everybody <laughs> watching live and on YouTube. Um, yeah, so uh, I want to thank the Twitch subscribers who oh, helped support the show. You. Scrolling right there. Al the for Android Atari, Arms Guard Coder, Atari Nate 74, Atari, Atari Dude, BR Pokop, Bruno Stice, Burst, Error, Captain Class, Chelsea Bond, Donnie Mal, uh, Charles Whelan, Chitlala, Conquer Rager, Sierra Reboot, who's in the chat, Yay, who made, made this game. Uh, Dan FC DMC, Drexel, Dr. Mook, House, Eric Carr, Gamma Dev, Gisbelto, Rondinella, Great Defender, Ground Trooper, JG, Johnny G, Johnny WC, Computer Coder, I better get that right, I'm going <laughs> to see him in a couple yeah, days. There you go. Computer Coder, Carl G, Karakrak, Karaku, 2600, Developer for Lambda Express, Mississippi T, Mark Hans, Mark's Basic, Metal Atari, Metal Learner, McMuse, Mike Soul, Mike Tom, Mr. Fix, Mighty Funster, Nostalgic Pack Rack of Prow, Seven Coag, or Enters, Render Goes for Penless, Feedy Rabbit, Tilly, Six Weeks, Spitty B, Spiceware, Spinley's S. Ramirez, Strawberry System, The D Train, Thrust, TKD, KT, Fos, Trek, MD, Vintage Game Marys, Vitoco, VVJ, Double Down, NX, Ken X. If you want to support the cats and the show, oh, there's here a he cat. comes. Here's Sid. You can can too uh by uh clicking subscribe it is free with amazon prime spend jeff bezos money before spending your own mm -hmm. uh or if you want to know when we're broadcasting at odd hours like this uh just hit follow and it'll pop and up know. on your you'll cell phone know. if you or, have time you yep. can join you can watch you can feed yep. these cats some treats if you've got oh, some yes. bits if you have bits yes, give them to the cat spare like. a bit for a cat yeah starving please, sir, kitty but i have some more meow, meow, meow. Yep. um some news we normally don't do news on after dark but uh oh. we're coming up to prge so there's lots of news coming yeah. out about that uh the first one is uh another announced release by atari age that's going to be uh releasing at portland retro gaming expo <gasps> Uh, Night Guy in Another Castle Ooh, Atari, for, the, for the Atari 7800. Nice. Uh, really fun platformer. Oh. We played it on the show the other day. Mm -hmm. so we played all the demos. Uh, if you like platformers and you have Atari 7800, this is the game to get. Yes. It's creative. It's fun. It's so much challenging. Fun. So much fun. It's really good. Um, yeah, definitely pick it up. Check it out on our stream if you think you might like it. Uh, also... This is going to be uh, playable as a demo mm -hmm. at PRGE at the Atari Age booth. Magic Pockets oh, from a Reboot the just Brothers. announced okay. uh, yesterday night. Uh, Magic Pockets. Um, I uh, was, it's also a platformer as well. I uh, was beta tester on this game. It's super oh, fun. Oh, so you, you very played challenging. it before. Excellent. I have played it before. Excellent. Um, we will be playing it on the show. <laughs> uh, those guys are dodgy. <laughs> oh, Cyrano. <laughs> Re Reboot? Yeah, I agree. Yeah. I agree. They're super dodgy. <laughs> they keep releasing these games. Yeah. I don't know. We're playing one tonight from them. Uh, yeah, it's super fun game. If you like platformers, nice. you will like this game. Um, I'm very, looking forward to trying it out. Very unique way of playing, kind of bubble bobble-ish. Like you're throwing things at the enemies. Mm. Uh, there's candy and treats in the game. Mm. Uh, there's power-ups. Um, but it's not like bubble bobble. It's, mm. it's a big expansive screen. It's not a flip screen game. Um, but you can try that out at the Atari Age booth and uh, give it a go. See if you like it. Awesome. Uh, it's still a work in progress. Um, but you can play it. Let's see. I think that's just all the news really, really quick. Oh, stupid pop-ups from my phone. <laughs> uh, yeah, let's get into the game. But first, let's find out about the contest that is running also put on by Machine, mm -hmm. who has run 
a bunch of these other contests for reboot games. Um, uh, he says, it's time, Last Strike DX contest. This will be the sixth contest. We won the last one. I won with a high score, only because somebody dropped out. Yeah, so now I have a Jaguar tie. Yeah. Um, You're going to wear it to uh, Portland, right? Uh, <laughs> He's not a tie guy. No, not a tie guy. <laughs> but it's very nice. Yeah. Ah, no. <laughs> Don't quote that accidentally. <laughs> Uh, this will be the sixth contest this year. It was a blast playing River Raids, Rebooteroids, Caravan, Karibashi. Is that a, it is a Jag flag. I, I was like, of all the things on that screen, I want that Jag flag. Jag flask. Flask to take with you. Kobayashi Maru awesome. Caravan, Shadows Mothline, and Biopede Caravan. Nice. Reboot keeps turning out fun games, so let's have another contest. Um, so yeah, it looks like a sticker, mm -hmm. a patch, a button, Mouse pad. Mouse, okay. mouse pad. Yeah, it's, it seems like a small mouse pad. Might be something else. Um, oh, a, a card maybe, like a, oh, a postcard. Oh, could be a postcard. Postcard maybe. A pair of socks. Uh, is nope. it? it? Yes, because we have them. Is Those... it one continuous? No, no, they're two socks. They're socks. Yeah, okay. they're folded over. Very. It's a pair of socks. <laughs> very cleverly folded over. I swear we have those. Socks. We do. We do. <laughs> yeah. And a Jaguar flask, that which flask is, is obviously is the highlight of this. Very nice. Yep. So you can sneak your pop into the convention yep. hall <laughs> at PRG. I of course, know. your pop. Yeah. Um, Last Drag DX contest. The high scorer will receive free Jaguar swag items. Don't think you can compete? No problem. One person who submits... Uh, one random person who submits nice. a score will receive a prize. Everyone who submits a score will be entered into a second chance drawing. So post your scores. That's nice. That's nice. So even if you don't get the high score. So me. You're directing that at me possibly, is what you're saying. <laughs> possibly. You won't get it because we do the draws on ZPH oh, I for know. that. No, no, no. That's fair enough. But um, and that wouldn't work. <laughs> wouldn't work. But uh, Kara, you're direct, Kara, directing it at... Gamers like me yes, is what I'm saying. Yes, I'm probably not go. in the running for the high score, but I will still play it and enjoy myself. Yeah. So, so the rules yeah. for this game, you have uh, the pilot skill level, rookie. Okay. Set it to three lives. Three lives. And okay. post your high score. Okay. Contest runs until Monday, Ooh. September 30th. So you have eight days to do this. Okay. And we're leaving for PRGE, so... Yeah, we're not going to we be able to do it We wouldn't be able to do it later. Um, oh, No. So no. <laughs> this is kind of our last chance, so that's yeah. why I picked today. Yeah, fair enough. Uh, just post a picture of your score. You can post as many scores as you want. More chance for a second ch uh, chance drawing. Some lucky person Party received time it. for kittens. <gasps> cats, 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 cats. Did you see his head go up? Did you see his head? Oh, yeah. Yeah. He's excited. He's like, something's going on. What's happening? Cats, cats, cats. Cats, cats, cats. Gamma Dev. Woo, thank you, Gamma Dev. Gamma Dev is so generous with these kitties. Yes. Yes. some... Coasters. Coasters. Sparkly, sparkly coasters. So let's put those out. I'm making this more right second now. Second chance drawing will be held live on Zero Page Homebrew Show after, after we get back from PRG. Are you ready for some catnip? Catnip time Are you ready for kitten cats. For some catnip. Oh. Oh, no. don't. No, stay on your side. Oh, vicious. Stay in your lane. <laughs> No, no, don't let him do it. Don't let him do it. This is your catnip. Don't let him that's, be a bully. That's your catnip. Eat your own. Let Atari have some fun. <laughs> yeah. There you go. Yeah, Atari's like, this is mine. I'm laying on my catnip. That's my catnip. You can't get it now. I'm just going to roll around in it for a while. <laughs> Look at him. <laughs> I didn't, oh, they're so happy on catnip. I didn't write that. I'm not directing anything. <laughs> what? 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 I didn't say your name. What? What? Karawadi? Oh, well. I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> hey, hey, no, no, uh, no. Stay on your side. No. So, Come um. Back. Come back. Come back. Come back. Oh, scorn. Come back. Nope. No, not for you. <laughs> Vicious. Nope. Nope. Oh, he's so bad. Just, yeah, give that it up. That Atari's like, ugh. Give it up. So, oh, what a so bad if you kitty. want Last Strike DX, uh, it is available to, um, get uh right here last Strike dx full game 3550 uh last Strike dx is an update a huge graphical update of the game uh 2019 release last Strike published by atari age nice. several gameplay changes have been made along with a handful of non-critical bug fixes and most strikingly an all-new graphical update from the pixel master and Alex. it looks 
gorgeous mm -hmm. absolutely gorgeous so it's available there i've posted it in the chat if you want to play it and compete excellent and or compete um yeah so let's go back to the cats for a second while he's we being get, a silly oh he's so happy oh he's like game. i now have all the catnip for it's two cats all mine it's all, all mine two of them he's such a greedy little greedy little entitled okay, kitty. how sad he is oh, i know he's out in the hallway Oh, oh he got a little bit. He did get a little bit. He he mashed some of it into his chest before he got chased Just away. So mean. This cat is so crazy. And Atari's like, ah, oh, he's the baby. I have to give it to the baby. Yeah, a little, little brother. So, there you go. Can't can't uh, make him unhappy. No. What about your brother? Says, no. <laughs> F him. <laughs> None for him. Oh, <laughs> I want all the nip for myself. <laughs> it's so good. <laughs> He's a happy cat. Okay, load her up. All right. Let's get it going. That's the one. Yay. Last Strike DX 2024 reboot game. Six meg cart. Come back in. For six meg. Come game. back in. Come on. So there are some high, po high scores on. posted already. Um, let me see. Jaguar. Jaguar, as they pronounce it. Jaguar. In the colonies. In the colonies. <laughs> <laughs> of, oh which, of which we are not one anymore. No, there's no colonies anymore. Um, <laughs> so the highest score is 441,480 by Editor B. Uh, the second place person is Mad Windowman with 426. And then it looks like Grips 3 has been dominating these. I started games. this, but I have no idea if this is rookie or what. Oh. So I think I might have to re restart. <sighs> Reboot? <laughs> okay. I just, just hit go, just but I thought there was nope. going to be nope. a, this won't a count. choice. Nope, just hit. No, die. Okay. Die. Just die. Boom. Doesn't Boom. count. We're not even counting it. Okay. Just crash, crash into the pipe, right into the pipe. You can move left and right. Crash into the pipe. But look at the gorgeous graphics. Oh yeah, oh, those backgrounds are stunning. Beautiful parallax. Good luck beating that Psst. lull. Atari, come over here. Psst. Atari, Psst. no. Bad kitties. Oh my gosh. Yeah, okay. Okay, careful. And just go to the end. 225 points. Yeah, that is not my score. B to continue. <sighs> B to continue. Re, re, oh, it said rookie. Uh, okay. So it just uh, said B to start. I don't see options. any. There we go. Matt load rookie. So three. Rookie. Okay, so it's already so okay. So it's the default. Okay. Okay. He is a cat's acting He's sketchy. mad. He's very upset. He's very upset. Come over here. Come. Um, go back and get some. There's tons of catnip on the ground, baby. Thank you for hey! resubscribing, Charles Wheeland. Yay, thank you. Okay, let her rip. We need to start, and we're going to skip Pause all. Pause and star hash will quit. Oh, okay. Pause and star. That's, okay. that's the rage reset. Can't even see the star. No, they're not. Ah. Oh, okay. So Zero, points. Zero points. Ah. Zero points. Zero points. Yeah, man. 175 points. Yeah. Oh, oh I didn't mean to do that. Oh, oh well. The other one's I've the forgotten. Bomb. A is I've the bomb. Forgotten. A, A is. is. Yeah. Don't need that. You have to collect the spaceman. Sorry, right, come here. Come cuddle with us. Come cuddle. Oh, terrible. You're getting in my way here. Come force cuddles. Oh. No, no. Oh, he's not having any of it. He's not having any of it. Oh, you, yeah, you have to avoid... That's, no, I, I already need to reboot. <laughs> I, I, I'm still getting used to the... Um... Long time no see. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Glad you could join us tonight. Oh, careful. oh bombing. Mid-air bomb. Hey, it worked. Yeah, it Sorry. did. Oh, totally worked. 
Yeah, everything is... It, nothing will hurt you except for... Ah! Oh, perfect aim. Except for the bullets and the pipes. And, of course, crashing into enemies. But none of the rocks in the background will hurt you. Stop it. Why are you chewing on cables? It's not allowed. Oh, right into the ground. <laughs> not allowed. <laughs> okay. Let's start that over again. This cat is full of beans. Full of beans. Bean cat. Very beanie. Very beanie. Okay, right, let's give this a better go. A is exit. Thank goodness. <laughs> skip over. It's beautiful, but we're but we're not, not gonna time. spend the time. Yeah. Hey! Stop chewing on the cable. Oh my god. This cat. You gotta stay here. Stay here. Stay with me. Stay with me. Calm down. Calm your beanie self down. Calm. Great kitty. Um, so, uh, yesterday we continued on with our, our Martin Scorsese, uh, film movie marathon uh day 10 we were on oh, oh worst possible outcome yeah. didn't get the spaceman and died yep that's how um, it works. there was only two movies yesterday uh one was a uh music documentary yeah um Who's the musician? Blocked oh, it out of my Bob mind. Bob Dylan. Bob, Bob Dylan. So Bob many. Bob Dylan. Ugh. Um, who? Sorry for all the bus. Bumps. I can't move left and right. You cannot move left and right. I'm not moving left and right okay. at all. Oh, there we go. Something funny. Oh, it was the uh, thing. Don't touch that thing. Good I, shot. I didn't, but that's okay. <laughs> oh, it might have stood. Uh, got tilted at some point. Um. Yeah, it was not great. It was made from a bunch of footage from a long time ago. It was a Netflix exclusive. <laughs> um, I'm not trying to be too judgmental there, but <laughs> oof. It was it was a bit a bit boring. I, if you like Bob Dylan, you probably yeah, might maybe, have enjoyed maybe you would have enjoyed it more. Um, it was like concert footage interspersed with just light stories about oh, wasn't low enough. Bob Dylan. <laughs> yeah, how yeah. awesome he is. Um, He's uh, a big fan of Bob Dylan. Yes. Martin is. Scorsese. He's made two films which is fine. Him. Yeah. Um, but definitely not oh, my favorite subject. Okay. Nope, nope. One more. One more. <laughs> you were playing this before we started this, this oh, no, stream. Oh, no, I wasn't. I was just you getting sound You were playing it a levels. little bit. Not even a, mm -hmm. like five seconds. <laughs> Uh, the second movie we saw, which was much more enjoyable, uh, was the, uh, Irishman. the Irishman, which is excellent. Excellent, truly, film. truly good. I forgot. I think, as you said, um, it was better than you remembered it. Yes, because we were in, in the, the theater, theater when we, in the we theater saw it. When we saw it, it's a three and a half hour film. It's it's quite long to sit in a theater seat. Yes, with no intermission, where which there should have been an intermission in the theater. Um, but theaters don't want to do that because actually th theaters should do that because it gives a chance for people to go out and buy more food from them. Yes. I don't know why they don't put an intermission. Why that's not a, a thing anymore? In, in films. Like there's super long films now. Um, you can't, you can only order at the beginning of the film on like special theaters, right? Crash into the walls. Oh, I know. I move too fast with this uh, control. Like, I move too fast. Not the controls. Are you looking at the chat? Yeah. Um, Just saying sound levels. Are they too high? Too loud? I'll turn down. Not they look enough. a little loud. Um, yeah, excellent, excellent film with amazing acting. Um, if you can't st sit still for a film, it's that, not, might, ah, that might twice. be a problem. Yeah. But uh, I don't mind long films if they can sustain it, and this one could. Robert De, Mir Robert De Niro, 
Joe Pesci. Uh, Al Pacino. Al Pacino. Um, cameos from a bunch of people. Anna Paquin. I mean, women don't get much of a role in the film. Yeah, you should do that. I know, I was like, <laughs> not paying attention. They should for movies over two hours. I agree. Anything over two hours needs an intermission. Just do it in between scenes. After a big pivotal scene, um, a culmination. I'm, yeah, I'm not against intermissions. I no. think we should go back to that a little bit. The only intermission wa that I've ever had in a film was Hateful Eight. That was the only film I've ever uh, experienced an intermission. I haven't seen too many of classic films. No, Like no. from the era where they did have intermissions. Yeah, on a regular basis. Yeah. Um, I've never seen any of those in the theater. Maybe I've seen some of them at home. But we watched Irishman at home, and we had our own intermission. And I think it was... What did we do? It wasn't feeding cats. That was before. No, no, we just, we just took had a, a break tiny, at tiny some break. point. Very tiny break. Right in the middle. But our next is the last one. Day 11 of the Martin Scorsese Film Festival. And I'm looking forward to seeing... Um, what is the film called again? His oh, uh, Killers one? of the Flower Moon. Killers of the Flower Moon. I really enjoyed it in the theater. So I'm hoping I still enjoy it this time. I got it on um, Blu-ray. I had to import it because... It's not being released here in North America for some reason. Or hasn't been yet, anyway. I think all the big points come from defeating the boss. Or possibly think, winning well, the game. That's a Oh, what did I hit? Oh, I oh, ran out of gas. Ran out of gas. Nuts. Okay, well, that wasn't great, but that wasn't bad. Theaters here are super cheap tickets. They also make the money from concessions. Yes. yes. So it makes sense to... Yeah. So that's your score, 12,740. Well, it's not great, but sure, put it in for now. Somebody could uh, uh, write that 12, down. 12,740. In the chat. Thank you. Uh, and put a, a T beside it. I guess I could have put it in there. Uh -huh. Next time. Uh -huh. uh, why stop for intermission when people just talk and eat and use their phone all the time anyway? Yeah. Charles Whelan said, no, just joking about your earlier comment about the sound levels. So oh, It wasn't okay. the actual sound levels. Uh, yeah. Super cheap. Yeah, they make your money on the concessions, which they overprice popcorn, which is fine by me. I love salty, salty popcorn. Oh. Um, but yeah, um, yeah, because we did take kind of a break in the middle. And uh, yeah, it's really, the acting is really exceptional. Really, really good. Um, the story's really both cool. like the older actors who play younger people, um, and the younger actors like Ray Romano who's in it. Oh, is so good in it! Fantastic in it. Um, who else? Uh, Frequent Bobby clap. Bobby Car Carnavale is in it. He's really good. Ah. Oh, that's okay. Got just just one of them. Yeah. Um. No, I thought it was really well done. Yeah, yeah really good. Uh, looks great. It's, oh, oh gotcha. Based on a oh. true-ish story. True oh. story. Uh, it's from a book, anyway. It is based on a true story. It's based on someone who interviewed one of the few remaining, uh, essentially the protagonist of the film, when he was dying. Yeah. And that's supposedly where the story comes from. Although there might be some creative license in there. Yeah. All about how Jimmy Hoffa was killed. And... Can you yeah, it's pretty good. that cat? He's fine. Tearing apart furniture. Uh, he's bad. <laughs> Just bad. Ignore the bad. Oh, uh, it's Kev said, the spaceship in the game looks like a mini R-type ship. It really does, And yeah. Cyrano Re Reboot says, any similarities to any other game is purely <laughs> coincidental. <laughs> that's right. It's a spaceship. There's only so many designs you can have for a spaceship. Oh, no. Kathy Menti D, wife, read about abundance of bent bucks in theater seats. Ew. Now I have to strip in garage when I come home. Oh, oh, no. oh, no. I've never heard that. No. Uh, I would say go to the theaters that have leather seats because 
they can't get really into leather seats like they can into fabric. Oh my god. That is uh, not a nice that's, thing to hear. That's horrific. Why did that you tell us? That is not good. I Why I did you tell uh, us? leather seats are the way to go. I think yeah. probably far less likely to have a problem. Tell your wife that. You're only going to theaters with leather leather seats that's from now on. Or the vinyl seats. Ooh. Ugh. Ugh. Yeah. Ew. Gross, yeah. gross, gross, gross. Um, will do, says Kathy Man. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. That might help you. <laughs> I mean, they can get everywhere, but still. Oh, yeah. That's not nice. Either. Uh, Gamada, this weekend I finally watched El Camino, the epilogue to Breaking Bad. We have not seen Breaking Bad, if no. you can believe it. I didn't realize it was a movie until I saw someone else post a reaction to it after they finished finished watching the complete Breaking Bad. Uh, wow. Well, we're working our way through the boys. Well, we haven't watched it in a while, but yes. No, we have to get back to it. Yeah. Um, we were watching... What did we jump to? Uh, we started watching Lord of the Rings. You don't seem to want to keep on with it. I kind no, of do. It's so... Uh... I know it's I not know. as good as the original, but well, I didn't think it was nothing, bad. Nothing is, but... Yeah, exactly. <laughs> I want... Just... Okay, so if the Rio has another um, uh, Lord of the Rings marathon, I want to do it for Christmas this Again? year. Yeah, We've that's going to be my official Christmas, like... Done it many times. Like, uh, event is going going to be watching, like, 12 hours of Lord of the Rings. It is very We've good. only done it once. We haven't done it many times. At home. Not, not in the theater. Not in the theater. No, not in the theater. I enjoyed it so much. It was so oh, good. Oh, so good. Watching it with everyone? Yeah. Oh, Cyrano says, I gave up with LOTR three weeks ago. Watching it felt like a job chore. That's not That's what I want to hear. That's how it feels hear. to me. It didn't feel like a job to me, but we only watched one episode, so... No, we watched the full first season, and I was like, eh, it's, the parts are I didn't okay. Hate the, I didn't hate um, oh season one. I thought it had flaws. I thought it had some flaws. I didn't think it was as good as, obviously, the... This cat. This, oh, he got... Oh, he has Bernie. Bernie. We need a Bernie alert. Bernie alert. Bernie is, Bernie's down. Bernie's Bernie is down. down. Oh, season two is even more boring. Oh, oh no. Okay, so well now far, you're yes. not helping me <laughs> decide me. on. Yeah, but we will continue. <gasps> what? No, Bernie is not for you. He's a bad cat. No, he's not a cat toy. He's not a cat toy. He was. He is now. Very very carefully and lovingly crocheted by hand crocheted across the pond oh look at him he's looking a little by fluffy Mud no mrs muddy funster by mrs muddy funster uh oh it's, it's boss time don't you dare how do people get hundreds of thousands of points he knows he's there Jeez. now please you leave him alone of course, Sid picks up attacking Bernie instantly. Yes. Yeah. yeah. He is. I mean, Bernie is the perfect like size. He's he's cat toy size. The so. problem with cats is once they know about something, Ugh. they're like, oh, I'm gonna do that and they're, attack it forever. Yeah. They'll yeah they'll he'll he'll think Bernie's there when Bernie's not even there. Do you yeah. know what I mean? Like it's now, it's now in his his tiny little cat brain that there's a Bernie up there and he'll keep coming back for him. But you have to keep. Defending Bernie. Oh, you're such a little monster. Yes, you are. Little Sid monster. Try Snowpiercer, they nailed the ending. I never read the because it was from a book, I think. I like Snowpiercer. I watched the movie, I was like, this world doesn't make any sense. <laughs> well, yeah, you 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 are good why at are they picking out logical love. Why are they expending energy? <laughs> uh, to, run a... to run the train when they could use that energy to heat themselves and make food and oh, oh no so it's not, not my last point is it? um yeah 76,000 so all the points are from the boss mm. as I thought still doesn't reach the hell levels of maze runner yeah, I don't think James watched Maze Runner. I watched Maze Runner. I think it's I read the film. first book. I do kids. really enjoy, I do really enjoy, like, even young adult sci-fi. I read a lot of sci-fi. Um, I'm reading the... Oh, oh my I God. I remember the name. I'll get him. He got him again. He... Okay, you, Bernie has to go up here for now. 
You're a bad cat. <laughs> uh, I've already forgotten the name of the book series. I think it's Adrian Tchaikovsky is the writer. Any of those I'm young that adults? Right not, that's not a young adult book, but it's but kind of a space of, opera esque kind just, of story. It's not for me. Story. I know you don't There's like that stuff. There's a bunch of teens. I love that stuff. And they all have to band together and <laughs> save whatever uh, and escape the thing and... Some are terrible. I will. I will give you that. Learn some are their magic absolutely terrible, but some are quite, what? quite well written books. Like they're written well. Ah, ah. But you're not. You're not a big oh my fiction God. reader. I you didn't it. get either of them. <laughs> Just suspend Bernie from the ceiling by a hook. Then you have no. a cat hanging from the ceiling with Bernie in his mouth. No. That's. that's <laughs> Look not, at that bad cat. Yeah. That's not the way to do it. Uh, Oh, I need fuel. Oh my god, I yeah, haven't been bombing anything. Yeah, the train can't stop or it overheats, which leads to the, uh, why isn't the train on a treadmill? <laughs> yeah, yeah, exactly. Oh. There's a lot of logical issues. I made it to the end. Oh my god. Well, Good I'm definitely job. getting extra... Get an extra life. You're going to need Where... it. But how many credits do I have? 37? Oh. Oh, you can even buy something more. Buy another one. Oh yeah, there you go. Just all extra life. If you want to. Unless you want a mega... Twin or shot. twin shot, rear shot. Okay. Oh, the speed up's only three, but you don't have enough. I don't need speed up. Okay. <laughs> um, Kathy Man says, still, I'm still trying to finish FX's Legion show. Been working on it for, like five years now. Oh, the twin shot is the awesomest. I remember now getting that twin shot. It's what separates playing well from playing bad. <laughs> So and you don't lose it between like lives if you die it's like nope it's all good oh there was one level i can't remember what level we played this before and i was like oh my god uh this level is brutal uh was it after this one this one was I think pretty it was. hard i think it but... might have been after this one. I mean, when you've done them enough they're not so bad but Shot, the wide shot is, is definitely a bonus. Do you lose it if you die, though? Uh, no, no, you keep it forever. Oh, thank so good. Good. I love the guys who are backwards. Like seriously, no, I don't think that's gonna happen. <laughs> no, no. They. I just remember playing this game last time. I was like, "What are you doing there? Just move into a better spot." Yeah. <laughs> Do you really I, think you're gonna get picked up? I don't. Nobody's think rescuing you're not you getting there. picked up. Nice try. Nice try. <laughs> like, crawl to a better place. Just like, come on. Try a little harder. Oh my gosh, the wide shot is really... yeah. Essential. Essential. Shooting backwards shots. I don't Good know for how... the things that go around you, but not necessarily for. What other, what other shows? Oh, you started watching Gravity Falls? Yeah. My niece, who watched it as a kid, was like, haven't you seen the show? She was appalled, I think, that we'd never watched it. Yeah. Um, and I'm like, that's a meme on the internet. Yeah. I recognize that. <laughs> yeah, it's a cute show. Very cute show. There's some laughs. I haven't seen it. There's some laughs in it. Oh, good voice acting. Yeah. Yeah, very good show. I like it. It has a bit of an X-Files feel to it. Like crazy yeah, monster, of the week. monster of the week kind of stuff going on and set in Oregon, I think. Uh, in the Pacific Northwest Pacific for Northwest, sure. At least. I think it was Oregon or Washington. I can't yeah. remember now. Anyway. In the woods. Very cute. Very cute. Thank you. Thank you so. <laughs> um, what else? We kind of go in and out with yep. shows. Yep. Some we Obviously, just... we've been watching all of Martin Scorsese's films, so that takes up a lot of time. Yep. Um, and the next film marathon is Charlie last? Kaufman. Oh, the next marathon marathon. Yes. Yep. So I'm <gasps> looking forward to that. Kaufman's all the movies I've seen so of crazy. his are so good. Yeah, they're so crazy. Yeah, he's just, he's just rubbing up against the box. Don't worry. Getting you guy, you're protected one by a, a guy that's shooting, and two, you're way in there. Uh oh, shot. Oops, sorry, dude. Oh, oh, oh sorry. remember the guys are all at the top, so yeah. you shoot in his indiscriminately. You will just kill them. <laughs> Well, 
luckily there is lots of fuel on this level. Yeah. I was not shooting on the last level because I was trying to get guys, but then I wasn't well, getting the at fuel. At a certain point, it's like the fuel is more important. Yeah. And then you go down, and then you have the final guy, right? Is that what... No, no, there's a boss, and then you boss. go down. Yeah. But really, making it to the end of level two is so is important in this game to get all these power ups and ex and buy ex buy extra lives. Yeah. So you can survive that. But it's the people who give you the coins, right? So you you do kind oh, of have is to. It? I think uh, so. I think that's where you get the money. Well, that from. cat is in chewing very very important cables. He's so bad. They're, they're bad. They they know they want. Uh, they want treats. They want treats. They want <laughs> attention and treats. And Pro work. tip, avoid getting shot. Thank you, Cyrano. Uh, really helpful. <laughs> I wish I knew that at the beginning of the game. That would have made oh. it so much easier. Oh, yeah, yeah, it went up. Yeah, no, that's that. They're, okay. they're where you get the points. And the next, the next. That is, yeah. oh, it's boss time. Boss time. Stage boss. Yep, people are monies. People yes, are R monies. is for rescues. Yep. So people they pay you monies. to rescue them. Yep. Yes, sir. You're looking at me mad. I don't have treats for you yet. Whoa, whoa, whoa. In a little bit. I mean... Yeah. They all have patterns, which is... So this one I have to get on my leg. It's helpful with the diagonal shot. Very helpful. It would take so long. It still takes long. I can <laughs> only get a couple shots in on the diagonal. I mean, he will, he will hit you, right, if he goes forward? Oh, no, God. he doesn't actually hit oh, you. Oh, that was very, very close. Yeah. You have to be all the way back, though. Just going to do that again. Almost, almost got him. One more. Hi. Yes, yes, I know. I know you want treats. I also hid Bernie. I had to hide him. Because Sid was trying to kill him. And we like Bernie here. I know you don't like Bernie either. Why, Why do they always pick on that one vulnerable spot? <laughs> okay, I have to get fuel this time. I was not, not doing paying so attention. Well. <laughs> oh, I was trying to get the guy. So hard. Trouble now. Oh, the shoot. You have to really pay attention to the, the, the things that shoot you. Yes. I'm not too trying for guys. No, don't. Just, just... just fuel. <laughs> oh boy. Damn it. Sometimes you have to go past Brutal. really fast past them. Come on. Yeah, exactly. I know, lick, lick, lick. I know, I know. I know. I know. Gosh, fucking down. This is, this is a very hard. This is brutal. Very, uh, it's very tight. Oh my gosh, you're you're pretty good on fuel, so. Good. Be a little. Oh, oh, oh. I think I got shot. I think you did. <gasps> oh. oh! Is that it? Damn no. it. No! That was good. Consumed yeah. in flames! Uh, oh, these lights are blinking out of sequence, sir. Well, see if you can't make them blink yum, in sequence. Yum, it's tree time! KGKS PSX! What did I get? 158, Yay! 250! Oh, sorry, Gamma Dev! Yay! <laughs> I was looking at the chat. Why are you shooting your astronauts? Yeah, exactly. <laughs> No. Yay, thank you, Gamma Dev. It is treat time for it kitties. Treat time for kitties. Are you treated up? Are Ready you going to destroy treats? Atari? Or are you going to just slightly destroy Atari? We will see. How Atari does win sometimes. Atari. Sometimes Atari wins. Okay, kittens, are you ready? Cats. 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 The betting cats, has cats, begun. Cats, cats. War crimes. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, well... Uh, friendly fire, not workers. <laughs> Unintentional. Unintentional. Hi. So, 
Hi. Yes. Place your bets. Yes. Get on the floor. You, you don't get them here. If you haven't played in a bit, there's some variation to SIDS. Yes, things. we've upped SID. SID is very good at this game, so we had to readjust. <laughs> yeah. So now that it's pretty much like one category for Atari winning. Yes. And then and then three categories for Sid winning. <laughs> yes. One to two, three to four, five plus. Yeah. Oh, someone put a lot of money Whoa. on Sid five plus. But Atari has won yeah. twice against Sid. So if you've never played this game before. <laughs> oh, nope. not yet, baby. Not yet. <laughs> um, you hit the predict button and you can, uh, I think, a, a minimum of 10 points, ten. Yeah. stream points or bits okay. or bytes. Is it bits or bytes? Uh, bits. It's bits. Bits. You can uh, wager 10 bits I mean, and bits, uh, but I call them bites. throw in a bet yeah, maybe, on yeah. one of the four categories. So. Yep. Two, one of the two cats and the four cat categories. Four categories. Yes. Puss in bets time. Sid is raring to go. He climbed oh up and goodness. rang the bell up here. There's a lot of confidence in it being either Sid or Atari with a lot of points. Well, Atari or oh, Sid with a lot of points. Somebody put down some money I, on Atari. I, know. I think Atari. It's very possible. Atari wins. Um, it's just the last few games Sid has been doing quite well with it. So yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, last one, he won only one by two. Sid only just eked it out, I think. So you have 10 seconds left. Yes. Throw your last bets down. Thank you, Nobody, Ken Gamadev. Nobody's on Sid one and two. Yeah. There's an open big area there. There's an there open slot throw there. Throw 10 down. Yeah. Ooh, no. That's not covered. Oh, Here interesting. We go. Okay, we'll see what happens. Okay. Are you ready, cats? Uh, all right. So. We're ready to go. The cats are ready to go. On I got floor. lots of treats in my hand. Who's going to hit it first? Who's going to hit that bell? There's oh. two very hungry cats. Let me reset to zero before that happens. There we go. Crazy. Oh, cats on monitors. Okay, and ready? Nope. Ready, go. Oh, Sid, Sid is off to the races. That's Atari. It's tied up. Atari oh, smacks it all over the I place. No, I know. He bounces it's it around so much. Help you, Atari. Don't do that. Sid. Sid up to two points. Atari's back at the bell. He misses. Sid's Swing back at the miss. bell. Oh, oh, Atari. Atari got it. Nope. nope, doesn't count. Can't tip it over. You have to ring it. Oh, oh nope, that was Atari. Atari's in the lead. And a Sid is having Sid trouble. Tried. Oh, Sid. He that went. was, he didn't ring it, although he yep. did knock it over. He went for the, oh, he's Oh, back. Sid again. Atari. Hit that bell, baby. Four, three. Good Sid Atari. Oh, Sid ate Atari's. <gasps> oh, no. Oh. Okay. <laughs> that's for you. Okay, yeah. Sid, that's another one for you. Oh, my goodness. Oh, he's a bad cat. There's Atari. And it's all tied up again. And Sid's back. Sid? And he's got it. It's six, five. It's all about the pink bell today. And There's Atari's Atari. tied it up again. Six, six. Sid, Sid. Has got up to seven now. Atari's back at the bell. He's going to tie it up before Sid. No, Sid, Sid gets it again. It's 8 6. Now Atari. It's, Atari's up to 7. There's one between them. Oh, it is, Sid. It is now game point. Sid is back. He is raring to go. And, oh, it's 9 8. Sid made by 2. Oh, he's confused. No, he's missing it. Doesn't really no. matter at this point too much. Oh, Sid, Sid got Sid gets it. it! Two points. And it's some all extras. Over. It's all oh over. Oh my goodness! So what does that mean? Did no one win? That means no one won. Oh my goodness! It's all over. It goes to the house. Who the house wins? All goes to the house. How many points did we win, James? We won. Let's see. I'm not it has never happened before. That's why we. That's why I always say throw cover at least the cover the spread, even if you only have ten to put yeah. on it. Sid won by wow. two points. Crazy. Prediction results is Sid one and two. No winners. No winners. So nobody thought this would happen. Did you see that? Yep. That is funny. So oh yeah. Nobody, nobody thought. thought this would happen. But it doesn't say how much wow. was total bet. No. Um, well, yeah, I can add it up. 5, 10, 11, 12,000. Wow. Down the drain. <laughs> well, thank Down you. Down to nothing. Thank you for participating. That's right. <laughs> Gotta do better next time. Gotta put time. at least 10 points on the, on, the, on the last. That's right. Wow. 
That is unique. Well, Never last have. time Sid oh, came, in, came late. in late to bed. Oh, Dan, next time. That would have been the perfect bet to yep. throw down. Yeah. Just the tiniest little oh, bit. Oh, my goodness. Okay, so uh, I don't think anybody put my score in, so I'm going to put it in the chat just okay. so it's easier for me. I will play one more. You yeah, can... you should, and then I'll, I can uh, give you a break. And, uh... Yes. Oops. Let's one five eight. Oh, that's pretty good. It's you didn't even make it to the end of level two, so if you can, yeah, even get a little further than that, that's that's good. Whoa! What the panic cats? <laughs> panic cats just panic. took off. Panic. <laughs> uh, you can put in J uh, if you want. J. Okay, we'll just do that then. And end. Bottom right. So now I've showed you how to play. You should be able to. <laughs> I thought you were going to play another round. I thought oh you just no, said after you were no, going no, to. after a little break. Oh, I see. Okay. You, you'll be able to give me a little break. C, C. Exit A. Exit. Oh, A. Sorry. It just just cancels. Yeah. yeah. Forgot what? the buttons are backwards. What? What is this? This isn't the same game. Oh, oh. restarted at the same level. Okay. Oh no no what no. What is no. it? What did they say? Option. Just pause and then the bottom two. Uh, it doesn't work. Uh, it doesn't work at all. Sure. Enter. Now I'll have to read the instructions carefully on the screen to not continue. Uh, okay, B to continue. Yeah. B to continue. Okay. What is that? Rookie? No. Nope. Should be fine. Nope. Oh, it, that automatically set to the highest one. The last one. Okay, that's where it is. Okay. Okay. A to exit. B to go. Go, go, go. Starting. There you go. That's better. Definitely want to start on the easier level. It didn't say what level to start on. But it would be very, I think, foolish to start on a higher level and try and get a high score. Unless there's some big, big reward. Yeah, you definitely want to pick up those astronauts. Before I wasn't too, too concerned about them, but now I'm like, yeah, I like the extra lives. I think I'm going to pick up as many astronauts as I can. So this is obviously in, in um, inspired by, or um, scramble. Yeah, scramble, Super Cobra. They're both very similar. Um, which both games I absolutely love. I have the tabletop of um, Super Cobra. Um, I love them on the 7800. I love them on the. 2600 they're absolutely awesome awesome games and this is no exception this is unbelievable oh, yeah. oh and the graphic upgrade really 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 makes it so yeah if you like super cobra scramble you will love this game Oh, got hit. Did I? Yeah, you hit oh, one of no. the things. Yeah. Oof. What are you drinking tonight? Oh, just leftover um, sour beer from our local brewery. Right. You got a big jug of it? Uh, <laughs> Medium it's called, jug. It's called Growler. <laughs> not a, big, not a jug. jug. Of beer. <laughs> from, you it's a actually quite a small growler. Jug from the still. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, pretty much. <laughs> uh, <laughs> they do have big, big canisters of beer there. <laughs> oh. Sorry, you're making me laugh. Shooting, um, the, shooting the astronauts. I know, poor astronauts. Uh, they're suffering today. Um, 
Oh. Uh, it is a strawberry rhubarb sour beer. It's but good. I just had a tiny bit left. Delicious. It. It's did a little, you sample um, it when we went there? Yes, and I did. The, and that's the best way to go. Oh, that's good. Yeah, I'll they give you. They let you take little samples. And oh, do they? But yeah. you ordered some, actually. Oh, right? I ordered wine, actually. Yeah. When oh, there, wine. Okay. Which might go, why are you ordering wine? Like, sorry. <laughs> but uh, they, they also sell wine. Do they make that wine? They do make that oh, wine. Oh, okay. yeah. It's not the fanciest wine. Well, it's at a brewery. Um... So we went to a concert. Yes, we did. On uh, Thursday? Friday. It was, Friday. Well, part of it was excellent. <laughs> yes. It was, the opening band was James. Uh, it's not me. I didn't open. <laughs> um, I, I told him he should get the t-shirt that says James it on says it. says James. There's a whole bunch of t-shirts with James on them. I, none of them really appeal to me, and I'm not up to wearing a t-shirt with my name on it. Um, I had not really, I'm not really familiar with the band James, which is kind of strange. Uh, uh, yeah, you would think he you would think be. I'd investigate it at least? It's like, how dare oh, they? Oh, I'm how so mad at this dare guy. they use my name? <laughs> how dare? How dare they? I'm going to play they, one they more They were time. very enthusiastic on stage. Uh, the sound was good. Um, oh, they were complaining. no, they weren't that. The no, the sound was good. The sound? Well, the drums were low at the beginning, but then after a while, the drums they, and then, they, uh, they brought the know. drums up. We're gonna we're gonna agree to disagree on that <laughs> okay. one. Um, they were they by the end they, by the end they worked it yeah, out. They yeah. had some issues. They were complaining they were missing a whole bunch of equipment, which I've heard multiple bands go on stage and say that, and I'm like, eh, sounds fine to me. But of course, they're like, ah, oh, we can't play this instrument. This yeah, instrument. what song are we playing? It's, it's like, ooh, yeah, well, it was we can't a bit of play that song because we're missing this thing. It's like, oh, okay, don't play the song then. That's fine. Um, they, they were not my cup of tea. They were not a band I would listen to. They were, they were fine. Thank you for following Serena. Glad you are enjoying us playing this awesome Jaguar. Uh, uh, Jaguar. Jaguar. <laughs> Jaguar uh, game. Um, because it, uh, the game is made by an Australian, so I have to pronounce it correctly yes, in their did. native tongue of Australian. And if the game is made by a British person, I just also call it Jaguar. Um, but if it's made by North American, I can call it Jaguar. Jaguar? Jaguar. Jaguar. Jagger. 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 I don't know. Depends on Jagger. your accent. Um, yep. What was I going to say? Yes, uh, so that was part, that was the first band. First band. Yeah. Second band, Johnny Marr. Fantastic. And if you don't know who Johnny Marr is, you know what Absolutely fantastic. the famous band he is from. Yeah. He is from the Smiths. Yeah. Um, oh my God. He, he is, is fantastic. He is a guitar god. Yeah. He is post-punk guitar god. He's oh, not he's like so a rock good. guitarist or anything. He is, um, yeah, he's so post-punk. I have to so say, talented. he was so good. Like he was, I thought somebody else was playing his parts because he made it seem so effortless. The way he was playing the guitar, just like, and it sounded like a three guitars at once. Um, he played some Smith songs. He played his his own songs. He played two electronic songs. That's a band that is like a super group of. Um, you have to bomb some of those those flashing yellow things. Bomb it! Shoot it! There you go. You need to shoot more. Um, uh, electronic is a super group of. Ah, uh, oh, dead. Johnny Marr, New Order, Pet Shop Boys. Yeah. Oh, oh. Oh. What? Oh, somebody. Oh, it's a raider. I didn't even hear the raid. Didn't go off? Oh, ah. you did. Party of 40. Oh, well, welcome. Welcome. I didn't even hear it. Thank you for bringing over your, your party. Party, party, party. Um, we were enjoying watching her play various fighting games. Dead or Alive, Marvel vs. Capcom <sighs> 3, and Bomber Girl. It's a lot of fun. Excellent. Well, Thank welcome. you, Johnny Thank the Whiz Kid. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Yeah, we're uh, playing on the Jag. Yeah, I'm killing astronauts left playing, and right. Playing a, a update terrible. of a game from Reboot. And the developer is in the chat giving us crap. No. no. <laughs> giving us helpful hints like avoid the bullets. Yes. <laughs> um, if you want yeah, to stay alive, don't get shot. Uh, 
don't crash into things. Yes, yeah, that, that is very helpful. We're trying to get a high score in a contest with this game. I the high score is unbelievably high. I think I would have to get through eight levels to get that high score. I made it through. I made it through three, uh, three I just levels. The astronauts. <laughs> Sorry. So you have to ah. rescue the astronauts, and with when you get the astronauts, you can buy upgrades to your ship. Uh, after cool. every two levels, you get a chance to, you know, buy upgrades to your ship, triple shot, which is you need that, and you can buy extra lives as well. And this updated version of uh, Last Strike called Last Strike DX had a graphical update and some minor bug fixes from the cartridge release of Last Strike. Join the Wiz because I'll be attending the RetroCon this coming weekend. Yay! Awesome. We will see you there. Yes, definitely come up to us. We've got ah! coasters. We've got stickers. Um, we want to take a picture with you. I cannot remember what you look like. Um, I think I remember. So just have to remind us of your online name. Ugh. Or especially if you have an Atari age, um, Atari age lanyard, then we can see if you put Johnny the Wizkid on it. It's your subversary. Thank you for subscribing, JG. Oh my God. Four months. <laughs> awesome. Thank you. Oh, you have failed. Did you do better? Uh, I don't think I did. I think it was 17 something last time. I don't think time. I did. Press button. See your score? Oh, about the same. Ugh. Let me just type that in. Oh, Ugh. you've passed it. I can't type it in. Okay. Well, my turn. Uh, I'll make sure I'll add my pseudonym, pseudonym on, on my the name tag. There oh, you go. Okay, so you just add your real name. Okay, let's do this. Need to get some uh, extra lives. I need to rescue a lot. Um, Raider from yes, Serana XXXX. X, X, X. Yes, that's who raided us. Thank you. How did we miss that? I, didn't uh, I think hear the it. volume was down on my oh, computer. Oh no. <laughs> yeah, it was just down a Sorry, little too Raiders. low, or we were yelling, or the cats were causing trouble. <laughs> I think we we're just uh, talking too much. Yeah, talking, talking about, about the concert. Talking about concerts. Um, yeah, it was really, really excellent um, concert. By Johnny Marr. Johnny Marr played the guitar. Like uh, no really, just a master, a legend. Oh my god! Oh my god! <laughs> nope. Rage reset. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> too early. That's way too early. That's to way die. too early. Um, yeah, it was. It was excellent. It was excellent. He did point out that there were two other big concerts going on the same day, um, and if you looked at the seating. Uh, it was just over half sold out. Mm. Um, who, over half, really? It felt pretty full. I mean, by the time you did, started. Well, the, the area where we were in the lower Like in the area lower in the orchestra. Full. Uh, no, but it was, he was really, he was really worth seeing. Oh my God, he, so good. He's just amazing, an amazing guitarist. So that music uh, is yep, something yep. you like? Yep. Yeah. Do you like the Smiths? Oh, I didn't. Uh, no? For a while. Really? I just didn't like his uh, Marcy's voice for a while. No! Oh, so, shooting the astronauts. There's, there's a bunch of... Oh, poor astronauts. A bunch of singers I didn't like at first, but then I started liking. Um, one was Robert Smith from The Cure. I didn't like his... Yeah. And then Morrissey. And uh <laughs> Cyrano. Cyrano says back again, wandered off to find munchies. Did you beat it yet? <laughs> oh, three I looped it three times. Yes, that's the what whole game. Yeah. Yeah. No oh, poor astronauts. My money. I care not for the astronauts, I care for the money <gasps> that they give me for rescuing Ooh, them. Psychopath. It is uh worth it to rescue. So. I care a little bit about them. Sorry. I like Morrissey's voice. I just don't like him. Oh, yeah. he is. He's he wasn't there. Don't worry. It was just... <laughs> he wasn't there. Yeah. They had... There was a whole kerfuffle recently between them. My hairdresser. Really? My hairdresser is... Um, huge fan. Huge. Well, 
Huge fan of his music, not of him. No, but of that music. Yeah. Yes. Um, and he told me all the details. Yeah. About yeah, here you go. the possibility of the Smiths getting together and really and Morrissey's like, oh yeah, I send the papers and it's Johnny Marr just is holding back. And really? He got all the rights to the the music and blah blah blah. Okay. And and then turned Johnny out not Marr, to be true. No, it <gasps> didn't turn out to be true. And Johnny Marr posted something and told him he was full of crap. <laughs> of course. Um, and he's like, yeah, I got all the um, the rights to the music because there was, like, somebody was going to use it for some other purpose that was not good. <gasps> really? I can't remember the details. Yeah. Anyway, nobody cares. But he was, he was telling <laughs> you about that. Yeah. No, no, it ah. is interesting. The drama is, yeah. is certainly interesting. It's because uh, some other band got together that hadn't been together forever and somebody was theorizing like, oh, the Smiths should get back together now. Yeah. So one band getting together doesn't, doesn't mean, mean another other one bands is, are yeah. getting together. Oh. Good job. Thank <laughs> you. Yeah, Rob Smith cannot sing a happy song. Well, this is true. I don't mind. I don't mind him not singing happy songs. He sings very melancholy songs very well. And that's why I listen to him. Oh. Uh, no! What? Well, what's the point? That's the beginning of the level. <laughs> like, why? Oh, well, I guess that's true, yeah. Why? Why would I start over with one less life? Oh. <sighs> Checkpoints in this game are far and few <laughs> Cyrano's between. pro tip number two. Don't hit the walls. Oh, the walls. Yeah. They get in the way and... All over the place, these walls. Cats are meowing. Cats are losing their fluffy little minds. What's going on, Sid? And Sid learned how to make biscuits the other day. Oh, yeah, yeah. For the first time, I'm like, wow, he's doing it. Yeah. He never did it before. So I thought cute. they did that when they were little babies. I thought so too, but we'd never seen him do that. You know, when they push, 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 they yeah. little paws into you and massage you or whatever. <laughs> yeah. No! Yeah, he hadn't done that before. And now he, he's doing it a bunch. It's very cute. He is very cute. And now he's chasing going. invisible mice. I don't know what he's yeah, doing Yeah, right he's now. going nuts. Invisible Bernies, because yeah, I hit Bernie like, away. It's like, well, I'll chase the other the, Bernies the around other the other Bernies house. that I'm seeing post-catnip. <laughs> post-catnip Bernies that he's seeing. Oh my gosh, he is, he is going nuts though. He's full of beans. So many oh, beans are in that cat. Beans and catnip, what did you do? Did you steal Bernie? Did you find him? No, he just, he just got him. Oh, bad. Laptop got unplugged. Probably Good job. caught himself on I it. I think he did, yeah. <laughs> I think he's smart enough to what just you, What are you seeing? What are you seeing down there? He's seeing all the no he's seems. playing his own, um, his own game today. Yeah. Ah, shot one. This is very good challenging shooter. I love this game. You love games. Similar to Scramble. Yep, Super Cobra. Super Cobra. It's gonna be, this is right up your alley. Kitten. Ah! Oh. Damn it. Kitten! Psst. What is up with you? Only if you have a cat who gets like this. <laughs> Feel free to regale us with your stories in tell, the chat. Tell us their name. Yeah. Those are kitty names. Silly things your cat has done. Any similarities to Scrabble and Super Cobra are purely coincidental. <laughs> in a good way. In a good way. Yes. Oh. oh. 
I mean, there it is different because there's power ups. Oh yes, but there's there's all the graphics are different. If you like the different. style of game, is all the map is different. It's a shooter. It's a yeah. cave shooter. Yeah, cave That's, shooter. No, no, no! Uh, nothing wrong with inspired by games. No. Because if you're inspired by another game, that game is good. The inspired by games are even better than the original. That is true. Yeah. We wouldn't have all those uh, interesting Pac Man like maze games yes. if it weren't for people putting Trying their own to spin make their on own Pac Man, Pac -Man and yeah. Pac Man games. Yeah. We wouldn't have Wizard of War. Right? Without people going, ah, oh, I think I can make a maze game too. Yeah. Wouldn't have Mousetrap. Millions of them. <laughs> so many. Get those guys, get those guys. I'm going to deal with that little issue. Okay. No, I bombed oh, a guy. No, it's not your fault. Mistimed bombing. I'm gonna make it twerk and get my extra lives. Oh my god. That was very lucky. Pack line versions later, says Cyrano. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> yeah. Well, that uh, is. Yeah. Yep. Yep. That's an interesting one. Yeah. <laughs> I'm guilty of that as well. Yes. Stage boss. Team virus is this, approaches. Is this where he is? Right in the middle here. This where he is. Let's see if I can get a ton of shots in. Oh, you did pretty good. Yeah, that's a bunch of shots. Pretty good. It's definitely easier than the second boss. At least faster, anyway. Mm. The second boss isn't hard. It's just, it just takes a while because he prevents you from shooting a lot. Are you going to say hi to everyone? Pac-Line is the flappy bird of our time. <laughs> it is, yes. It is. This little guy right here. It's like a simple, this it's a simple game guy. to make, and that's why I picked right. it as my first 2600 right. game. Like, okay, one, one, two directions of movement. This game has music. It does have music. Is he calm now? Not really calm. He's calm letting me ish. hold him for like two seconds. Yeah, he's he allows you to do that. He's really full of furnace. I can, <laughs> it's just full of energy. See how many oh, you're so cute, though. guys I can pick up way through here. I've got 35. That's not bad. Speaking of which, James and Tanya, how about scores on Flappy Bird testing on links? Mm. What? Flappy Bird testing? There's Flappy Bird testing on links. <laughs> what is that? We will always play Flappy Bird on links if yeah. such a thing exists. Flappy Bird? I don't remember. Have you developed a Flappy Bird game? Is that what you're saying? That you would is like that, some testing done on? Is that, is that the ah, implication? Ah. <laughs> I need to bomb some, some I, fuel I, I here. I play Flappy Bird on links. Oh yeah, flat work is fun. Yeah. Especially if you oh, oh. didn't know it was gonna come out there. Maybe next run, turn the FX down and the music up. Yeah, oh. we can do that. Oh. oh. Yeah, we'll adjust that, Cyrano, Damn so you can hear it. it a little bit more. I definitely agree. The um the FX are quite loud, so. Yeah, compared to the music. Uh, the testing appears to be part of the name, haha. <laughs> I see. <laughs> oh, how about scores on Flappy Bird testing on links? Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. We can play Flappy Bird on links. Oh. See how high yeah. I score? We can. Oh. It would not yeah. be very high for me, I can tell you um, that. <laughs> Flappy Bird is either really hard for me or really easy. It doesn't yeah. seem to be like. Um, There's no in between. In between? Oh, why? Why? The, the hitbox is so bad. There we go. Hitbox makes me mad on those guys. I need Only to when remember you're going to down, get fuel. Up and down. Yes. Oh, you've got I'm lots good. of fuel right I'm now. Good. This is the end. Is it? A bunch I of stuff shoots at you. Oh, no, it's not the end. This is the end here. There we go. Pretty sure. I thought last time it was the end. Oh, maybe I it's think, this. I think it is. Oh. Nice. 
Nice. <laughs> Pew. Okay, 42. Okay, well, we're going to definitely get the twin shot. Because that's... Is there a maximum number of extra lives you can get? I don't have enough money to max that out, so... Four, okay. No, you can't get another one. Seven. It's making you can get a noise. speed up if you want. Uh, I don't... Do you like no, the speed up or no? No, I think I'm at a good speed. Okay. I don't really... Some games, they offer you speed ups, and I'm like, uh, I don't want to go any faster. Can't control myself. You, ju you just start hitting. Like, you just start hitting the walls too easily, I find. And I think the initial speed is really good here in this game. And plus, I'm used to it. If I got a speed up, I might have to readjust my gameplay. Time to kick ass and get all the guys because I was avoiding them last time. Oh yeah. my god, how you're, did I you're shoot across them? the top, really? Yeah. You're just shooting too much. I still have to make it to the end yes. to spend all this money, but... But, yeah, those those small portions there... Ooh. Ooh. Careful not to shoot them when I can't see them. Ooh. That's not a good spot to be in. When yeah, those, those guys, guys can go in. through everything, and I can't. Yeah, that's true. Cheaters! Such cheaters. <laughs> so bad one. So unfair. But, you know, I, I'm i taking out their whole Whoa. army single-handedly, so... There's a bit of unfairness already built in. Spot, and I will never, ever, ever pick you up. <laughs> only ever. if you have backwards shot. That's the only time you can do it. Yeah. Then I, I would feel like if you had back to backwards shot, then that would be possible. Default speed was one of the changes we made. They're quantum phased. What? What's quantum phased? Oh, the oh, I see the enemies. That's how they're able to go through walls. Oh, they're quantum. Okay, yeah. Okay, sure. Phasing through the walls. Yeah. It's funny when you read a chat slightly like, out of context, ah, it can be very confusing sometimes. Yeah, it's like, what, what Wait, conversation what, what, is this what, pertaining yeah. to? Looks like they're giving me the finger, which I don't blame. Yeah. You're either waving or giving me the finger, depending... It just depends if you're an optimist or a pessimist. Or if I pick them up or shoot them. Yeah. I can understand. This next part where you're going down the um, oh yeah it's hard it's so tight that's why I would not want to have fast speed I don't want to be a good payday after I get through this I hope and I can get all the lives all the lives not happening. They're also not collision detected against the background. Well, that makes sense. There's guys up there. Yeah, there's just one. Not worth it. It's too tight. It's easier. These guys then come those in. guys come in, yeah. It's easier to go on the low end of that particular spot. That's so beautiful. The backgrounds really are gorgeous, Cyrano. Underwater. Andrew oh. Lex did such a great job. A who is it? Andrew, Andrew Lex. Andrew Lex. Ander. 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 Sorry. I, I do know that name. Um, yep. She says all the names. <laughs> uh, for the Atari Homebrew Awards, so. Yeah. It's like, I know the names. I also embed them in resin. <laughs> <laughs> that too. Which are all done now. So. Yay. Yeah. They're all done. 
people will be getting their awards finally. Yes. And their certificates and yes. their envelopes. Hooray. Ooh. <laughs> yes. <laughs> finally. Oh, they're coming. I think uh, I promise next year they will be might faster. be shipped from the U.S. too, so yes. which might make it a little easier for some people to get them on time. I don't know. Yeah. Depends on where difference. they're going. Okay. Okay. This one's not hard. It's the next level. Just need to know the patterns. Get them before this year's awards. That's the hope. That's the hope. That's the hope. Gotta stay on top of it. Comes in at one point to the middle. That's the problem. It comes in. No, not this time. Just have to stay middle, middle. Yeah. Oh, there. He shoots forward. That's the time when you get a bunch of shots on him, actually. Yeah. It's actually a good time. Well, I mean, you could probably stay in the middle of him the whole time. The whole time. Actually, you can. Like, this yeah. is almost the perfect spot. You don't have to move at all. Yeah. Now for trouble. Yeah. Oh, my God. I don't think I'm going to try for any astronauts. And if I get any, it's purely by coincidence. Try not to die. I just don't have time. It's the get the gas. Yeah. Honestly, you you already oh. have a ton of them. I wouldn't even try. No. You have so many of them right now. It's just so dangerous. I, I would just play the let's oh. try to stay alive game. God damn play it. Play the stay alive game. Yeah. <sighs> yeah, it's very hard. <gasps> oh. Stay alive game. Don't <laughs> go for the astronauts. I know. Not helpful. Not even remotely. It's not. Turning around under here is so slow, too. So you have to spin? Yeah. What? So hard to yeah, okay. It's a deadly passage. It is. Yeah, you have a very high bar for all the, the astronauts you already have. Yes. Like, you've gotten 35, so you're doing pretty good. I think the max is 40 if you can get, something like that. Oh. Really? Yeah, there's a maximum. <gasps> uh, Stay alive, game! <laughs> oh my god. Stay that. Cyrano, is there a maximum? It looks like there's a bar that fills up. Oh. So it's just I, a number, I assume though. I assume you don't get past a certain amount. Nine? What? No, not lives. Um astronauts. That's good to know too. Yeah. Damn it! They shoot you from below, which is awful. This level's way too hard. Well, at least I'm making progress. I've been here before. Shoot them. Moving too much. I want to make sure you get a little bit more in the way of the fuel. Um, or just, just, right just a bit focus a bit on fuel. Um, you're not too, too bad. Oh, you did it. Oh. <gasps> you did it. Uh, yeah. Extra lives. Oh, I can't remember. I'll ask seven years ago <laughs> when I see him next. It looked about a 40. It looked like the, the bar there matched out a bar? of 40. There's a bar. Every it's time you get number. them, the upper bar oh. fills as you get them. And then the lower bar is your fuel. Upper bar is shield. There's shield and fuel. Those two bars. Is that what shield is? That's that that thirty six is a constant number on the screen. Oh, but it seemed I thought it was going up every time you got a an astronaut. Uh, I don't think so. I, I swear it was, but maybe something else was making it go up. So I got extra lives. Uh, well, maybe I'm completely wrong. I thought <laughs> you were getting astronauts and the bar was going up. I mean, if you get fuel when you get astronauts, maybe not fuel. Well, just Your watch shield. this time. Well, I've been here. Before. It's in the manual. <laughs> it's in the manual. Check the manual. No, so yeah, it goes up every oh. time. You're, the upper bar goes up every time you get an astronaut. Okay, well then you get fuel. You get an astronaut. No, it's not. It's not fuel. It's the upper bar. The lower bar is fuel. Why would there be two different things for one for fuel and? I don't know. I'm looking at it. I'm just trying to. I'm trying to see. 
Yeah. The upper bar is related to the number of astronauts you have. Where's fuel now? Fuel is the lower bar. Okay. There is no health. Oh. You, you, I, there's no oh, health there's no bar. Health. There's no health bar. How do you know how, da how dangerously low you are on... No, because you just get hit once, I think. No, you get hit. Really? Multiple. I just got hit and I didn't die. When it collect this stage, the other is... Collects this stage, the other is total. Remainders from previous levels. Oh, how much further yes. do you have in the stage to go? S is shields. Yeah, shields is zero. But that's, that's a number. It's not the bar. The okay. bar is the number oh. you've collected this stage. That's what I thought. Thank you. Shields is, is just a number. And well, I remember this and level being zero. brutal. Yeah. I don't think At least I you have more lives made now. made it past this level. Yeah. No, I'm running out. I just lost two. Holy crap, you It's too much on the screen. Yeah, this is... This level is... It's a lot Johnny of stuff. Johnny Biscuits has got four new Collector Vision games, Mr. Do, Run Run, Lock and Chase, Ghost, and... Uh, GBQS or something. Read those a, again very slowly. Those I got are, four new collector vision games. Yes. Mr. Do. Very cool. Run. Mr. Do Run Run. Mr. Do Run Run. <laughs> Lock and Chase. You don't know Mr. Do Run. Lock and Chase is fun. Yeah. yeah. Ghost. I don't know Ghost. Uh, and uh, he says GBQS or something. It's a puzzle game with kick-ass music. Oh, okay. Cool. Um, and I got two new Zarkstar games, Stellar and Escape from Mars. Zarkstar games are good. Oh, uh, Collector Vision awesome. makes awesome uh, Coleco games. Yeah. Ah! <laughs> ah! this level! <sighs> ah! Every, those guys are protected behind very deadly things. This level. I swear I didn't make it last time on this level. Not even close to 400,000. Oh, well, Not someone has close. definitely gone past this level. <laughs> yes, and many more after this. I don't have any money to get extra lives, even if I do make it. Not seeing you use the smart bomb at all, yeah. Oh! Yeah, I usually don't in games. There you go. <laughs> because you I forget them. one. I always forget too. Uh, I'm like more concentrated and I usually die when I do it because I have to like, oh, when should I use the smart bomb? And then I start, stop concentrating. And you're like, okay, what is the bullet? What is the button I need to use? And then you die. Well, luckily That's on what this, to me. it's right here. It's very um, easy to access. It's not very smart. It kills people as well. Yeah, it's true. Oh, it does no. kill everything. Oh, but no. But it does kill everything, which is good. Bullets on the screen are insane. Yeah, this looks so full, and it's not an open area. There's so much. <sighs> Chop both of them in one shot. Good oh job. my god. Good job. Oh my god. That was okay. totally accident. Worry more uh, oh my god. about some fuel, because I think the fuel is getting low now. Yeah. Oh, it's boss time. Uh -oh. I think the... oh, you get your fuel back. Oh, good. Like, Ray... That's good. Because that would be it? very unfair. Raider... Raider... Rapid Babid Bada Boom. Bada Boom. Big, big Bada Boom. Big Bada Boom. I don't remember the pattern. Oh, oh it's bouncy. bouncy. Okay, that's bouncy. That's okay. Uh... Bouncy is fine. Ah! Oh, dead. Bouncy cap off. Oh, my God. oh, oh, and I didn't get to shoot him on the way in after I died. Well, that's the punishment you get for dying. I forgot he comes in too. Yeah. And then I'll address the chat. <laughs> now I know his pattern, I might be able to shoot like this. But if there's any indicator of how hard the next level will be based on <laughs> yeah. um, oh, previous levels, it's going to be just devastatingly deadly. Yay! Woo! Oh. Do, 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 do. Good job. 
Thank you. Thank you. John and Lewis Kid, I want to get two Intellivi in Intellivision, sorry. You can say it. Homebrew games it. that I can't find. I want Mystic oh. Quest, which makes your character run faster, and Raiders of the Lost Ark. I don't see any on any store online. I hope whoever makes them will be at the con so I can request them. There's a, there's a bunch of Intellivision. There's, yes, I there mean, are. Um, Intellivision booths there. So, it's pretty popular. <laughs> I, I I feel like this is keep this your is the end of me. I only have one life left. Yeah. Uh, oh, is it? I don't, don't know if it's the life I'm on too, or too if it's a life in reserve. The guys and worry more about your again staying alive and making sure you have enough. Uh... I don't know if I can do that. Yeah, this is right. actually a little bit better than is the it? last one. Good. Last one was very tight. This is very cool. Mario. Very Super Mario. Um, uh, is it over? Is that the last? Oh, it's over. It was you good. Failed. You got I, it good. You got I think I got further. Oh, you did. Further oh. than I've ever been on this. I think maybe. Or very close. Yeah. Because I do remember that boss. It's a good boss. Ah, uh, so two thirty nine seven fifty five. I think. Turn the music up. Sierra wants you to turn the music okay. up but if we play again. Uh, you'll be playing again. Yeah. I think I'm done because the game is quite long. Oh, I could just put J. Uh, I don't know if you page. read that earlier. Oh. Oh, Johnny the Whisked. Woof! Uh, I just found out that Ghostbusters on Sega Genesis has a special edition where you can now play Winston and Lewis. Oh. It also has save features, and they made a transparent cartridge with slime ooze that glows in the dark. How oh, wow. That? that is cool. Slime ooze? Lilo. Slimer? <laughs> slime ooze. Oh, the effects is at six. So let's, um... Maybe three? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, we can hear it here. Okay, let's try that. We're back. You have to... The map, the map. I, back I, to I, zero. We have to press the button. Yeah. Is it Alice? Yeah, Alice. That was only four levels. I made it to the third level. <laughs> yes, it's a graphical update. A uh, massive graphical update. It's gorgeous. Gorgeous, gorgeous. Great. Um, Cyrano, you can put the, the link to buy it. Um, if you would like. Oh, yes. This definitely needs to be a physical one. I think this would, um, do really, really well. It's so, so good. I think even people that bought the original would buy this new update. Yeah. There we go. Cyrano has put a link to the game in the chat. Oh. Probably if you, if you hold it. Yeah. Too long. You have to. Oh. Yeah, you have to let, let off. Let off the gas mm. at some point. Oof. Ah. Oof. Oof. No. <laughs> no. You got him. Yeah, a big thing is learning or watching the timing on those guys that shoot because they are a constant uh, pattern of shot because you'll have to go in between them especially this one so you always go right after they shoot i'll be putting gravitic mines on the store as well in the next week or so oh very cool <laughs> Did I get hit? No, but you kind of went towards the shot and you just luckily didn't get hit. Yeah. You're like a cartoon character. I know, I, I'm, I or get a, all a cat at the side of the road yeah. <laughs> as, a, as a car passes by. I'm safe, I'm safe, I'm safe. The car's near! Yeah. Turn, turn across the road! Yeah. That's so true. I mean, that works with predators, but not with cars. That's why kitties stay indoors, right, what? kitties? It's true. Oh, oh no! Oh. I timed that very poorly. Very poorly. So we're looking forward to PRGE. It is very mere, looking forward. Mere days away. Five days away. Oh my god. So we'll be heading, oh my god. heading down the I-5 soon towards Portland. 
We've got all new filming equipment uh, that should make it so much better. Mm -hmm. Pretty much unlimited amount of batteries and streaming. You don't have to worry about crazy laptop equipment that we had last time. We had like... And, and the, the problem is the quality was so bad anyway because the laptop couldn't do encoding very fast because it didn't have any hardware encoding. It had to do all software. And so it looked like crap anyway, even though we're using an, a really good DSLR. It had to totally reduce the quality. This time we're doing it on a cell phone, which has built-in hardware encoding. So the quality looks really good oh. right off the bat. And we've got lav mics that um, are really good that everybody uses, those road lav mics that are wireless. Um, and yeah, everything just, it's all handheld. We've got a steady cam. Um, plus the steady cam of the camera built in as well. So it's going to be looking super, super smooth. Looking forward to finally having people play jumping at Shadows. Oh, yes, that's going to be awesome. People are going to love it. They're going to lose their fluffy little minds. Yes, they are. <laughs> it's so good. And uh, I'm looking forward to playing it on the show as well, pl doing a full playthrough. Like play a full through. playthrough, yeah. And during After Darks, yes. Oh, it's so good. Yeah, Such a good, game. challenging game. Great, great platformer with a tiny little bit of puzzle puzzle element to it to, to fi figure out you know how to navigate your way through and uh yeah the the whole the whole packaging the look to it the the black and white-esque yeah, oh, and, and then, then i hit it uh, yeah it's terrible it's a beautiful beautiful game jumping at shadows and I love platformers. Platformers and shooters. Mm -hmm. Luckily, uh, Reboot Games makes uh, mostly the games I like. Most of the genres I like to play. Yeah, so it's like he's makes like, me very happy. It's like he's Cyrano, ah! Cyrano makes right, me very happy with the games. Oh, you beat your score. 18. No, it was terrible. It was terrible. You do it again. Uh, yeah, you want another break? <laughs> Started doing basic groundwork on the next big game this week, so maybe around 2027. Oh, you're you're faster than that. You're really fast at making games. Unless it's a huge... Oh, the next big game. Big, big game. Okay. Yeah, those take a while. Yeah. There's lots of other people involved. The graphics and the music and everything like that. That's exciting. Can you tell us the, the genre it is? Is it a shooter? Is it a puzzle? <laughs> Is it a platformer? Is it a single screen flip game? Is it solitaire for the Jaguar? <laughs> <laughs> solitaire! Solitaire! Woo! Is it a collection of card games? Um, is it Wordle? It's, is it a monster trading card game? Oh. Turn digital? Oh. Yes, there you go. Magic the Gathering. Magic, magic oh the Gathering. Oh, right into it. But oh. not Magic the Gathering? No. <laughs> <laughs> yes, it is a video game genre. Oh, excellent. I love video game genres. <laughs> You're my favorite. It's a 3D open world, right? Fully yeah. 3D. It's, it's the game. It's a type of game that everybody's been always asking for. You're going to unleash the power of the Jaguar finally, right? Roar. <laughs> Roar. Is it a Jaguar game that has Jaguars in it? <gasps> Is it a cat game? Has such a thing ever existed other than the opening opening titles? No, no, I don't. I, I don't. Ha, were there, are there any actual Jaguar Jaguar games? That would be a good premise. I know. I know there's some some furries in the scene. I don't know if they've made any. I don't know if they've many made any Jaguar Jaguar games. That's funny. Trevor McFur is a Jaguar. There we go. Trevor McFur? Yeah, I think. Were they trying to make him like the unofficial official mascot of the Jaguar? Because it would make sense to have a Jaguar as as the mascot. Cutesy Jaguar with attitude in the 90s, right? Everything was what? attitude. With attitude? 
you know, everything was extreme. Chester Cheetah. Four times 16 bet. 64 bet? <laughs> If they were putting in the worst possible game you can imagine, didn't help. Yeah, you really gotta, you know, have it good right out of the gate with your, mm -hmm. with your mascot. Um, mascots weren't really a thing when the 2600 came out, so they really didn't have a mascot for the 2600. Not for the 2600, I mean... No. best one they could have was like the dot from adventure the dot from adventure yeah how about the uh, duck the is, duck from would, adventure should the duck be <laughs> duck from adventure could be be. The mascot yeah that could be that is that is one people people it's relate very, to that one very it's recognizable very, very recognizable uh the adventure duck the adventure duck <laughs> which was a dragon but no, it it's a, a duck. duck to everyone else. It was a duck. Oh, good shot. Uh, oh. Yeah, but Trevor McFur was a disappointment. No music, lame enemies, you're mostly blasting rocks. Do you think I War can be improved? The game really looks like it could be really good. I mean, we did a tour de force of every Jaguar game, and it's all pretty much a blur. All the games to me. Oh, we got fuel, though. What is I War? I can't remember. J War? J War. J -war? The sequel, J War. Uh... I War, the 3D mech shooter game? Oh my god, I can't remember. Uh... I have a terrible memory to begin my with. My god, so. I was actually not doing that badly that mm. run. Ugh. The game disagrees. I know, until that, <laughs> well, until that point. It's until usually... I died? I until was doing I died, awesome. Until I died, I was kicking butt. Get those guys. Got 23 of them. It's good. Uh, I wore the wireframe vector Tron looking tank shooter. Mm. <laughs> we played like 20 a day. It's too much. It was too much. I was the first person perspective 3D game when your computer eliminating viruses or something. Oh! Well, yeah, that one wasn't too bad. I remember that one. It was like you're in almost like a pit environment. There was walls on the side. Um, yeah, it needed... I don't know. We didn't... It was very hard to get into games that weren't pick-up-and-play arcade style. Because I'd never played them before. Tried to do as much research as I could, but oh my god, it was just too many games. Uh, is best of the tank games on the Jaguar? All it, <laughs> I think all it needed was texture. Well, it's hard to do texture. Yay! Oh, Miss the Lou cheered 500 bits! Thank you, Miss the Lou! Thank you. That was very, very nice of you. Texture would have tanked the frame rate. Yeah, you got it. I forget what this is. Oh, you just avoid. Just avoid. It doesn't come in and hurt you. Avoid the Tide Pods. Ah. What are you doing? They're so easy to avoid. Just avoid them. <laughs> Don't swallow the Tide Pods. Do not eat the Tide Pods. <laughs> Our dishwasher tablets look like that too. Very colorful. Yeah, Very tide pods. tasty, candy like. Mm. I prefer game, but you know, that's just me. <laughs> <laughs> uh, smells better. Yeah. yeah. I, think, I think in October we should uh, highlight our favorite candies. What? Throughout the throughout the oh, month of October. Oh, is is that an excuse to like eat candy? Yes. Get fat over the month of October. <laughs> Fatten up for the winter. Yes. I like it. I like it. I okay. like where you're going. We can highlight uh, Canadian candy. Yeah, uh, just any candy. It's gonna, just gonna be ketchup chips every episode. <laughs> that's not candy Chip. though. That's ca candy. Candy is like snacks. chocolate. It has to be sugary. Snacks. Snacks in general. Snacks. Lion bar. Ooh. What's a lion bar? Is that unique to Down Under? Oh, I don't know that I don't one. Know. What's your favorite? Um, probably like conventional chocolate bar. Oh, okay. Chocolate bar? Ones that I, I can't eat any now. What's that? Can I get, get through those holes? No, don't try. No? I think there's, I should. There's no conventional chocolate bars I can eat. So. 
free pre uh free changeover chocolate bars yeah before before you came, became, became vegan vegan um uh, oh, oh my god you survived it i don't know how um coffee crisp oh coffee crisp is 100 best that's canadian best um americans oh, oh. that's yeah, it for that's you. it for me Your that was my score. best score so far so oh, it's from the uk that's why i recognize ah. the name i don't know anything about it Coffee Crisp. Uh, oh, I s s what's the one that's flat? Um, it's got peanuts in it. 74. That's better. Oh, way better than my last because I 74. killed the boss. It's not a great uh, score. But that yeah. was fun. I love yes. this game. Cyrano. It's fantastic. Mint Arrow Bar. Not bad. Mint not Arrow. bad. Mint Arrow Bar. I do like a good Mint they Arrow Bar. They do make vegan Arrow Bars, so I have had those. Yeah. Uh, oh, chocolate orange. I, no. I like them, but he does not like fruit and chocolate together. So, I, a mint hero is It good. makes this um, um, very acidic mix when um, there's chocolate and fruit that I just can't. I've deal forgotten with. the name of the bar. Don't ask me. I obviously haven't eaten in a long time, but it's the one that has like caramel and peanut butter in it. Um, so good. I went through a phase where I would buy it all the time. Let's look at chocolate um, bars. Canadian chocolate bars. <laughs> Canadian chocolate bars. Cadbury's is no good in the U.S. Much no, better. No, it's not. Cadbury's they is... They reformulate it. Yeah. In, in, uh, in. Wonder Bar. I, I love a Wonder Bar. It's a little thick. It's got a lot of caramel and peanut butter. But, man, it's good. It's, like, oh, so sweet and crunchy. Coffee crisp? Yeah. Yes. Oh, I used to eat crunchy. I'm not a crunchy. I'm not a crunchy texture is kind of difficult. It's a little too dry for me. Eat more. That's the one. Uh, my Eat more. It's so chewy and hard. Yeah, I never liked. I those. loved challenging. I love challenging. You candy. wanted to challenge your 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 love your teeth. Is that what yes. you're saying? <laughs> stale uh, nibs. Stale, stale, stale. Hard as hell. Yeah. Um, licorice. Yeah. I love. So Canadian Smarties are the same as British Smarties. Yes. Although they do taste slightly different, I find, because the chocolate's different. That's disgusting. But Canadian Smarties are more like um, like chocolate M&Ms. Kind of. Would be the closest the closest. But Smarties thing. have a They're sour... They're a little thinner. A sour shell. A bitter shell. Not... not have you ever sucked a Smartie? Maybe more bitter than... Yeah, but it, that it's doesn't... Bitter. That makes it sa taste sound, sound like it tastes bad, and that's not the bad. case. Maltesers. Maltesers. I like Maltesers. The textures. But they're also a dry one. But yeah. Um, but they're smaller. I am a big Kit fan. Kit Kats. Of, um, they're good. The, the one that people always uh, make fun of. I, I do like a Junior Mint. Uh, people hate Junior so Mints. Boring. But I love I love that mint. Um, the Violet white crumble. mint stuff that goes in there. Violet, Violet Crumble. I've never heard of. Yeah. Um, oh, that's... That's just a, Oh, that's a crunchy. It's that's the same crunchy. as crunchy. It, it, it is a crunchy. Look at that. People they put are them the together. same. Yeah, so crunchy bar. So you like crunchy. Wunderbar, yes. Wunderbar. Uh, Wunderbar. Yeah, Wunderbar is my one of my favorites actually. And and at um and I think they have like a crispy layer on them too. But um oh, crispy crunch is good. Also pe peanutty kind of flavor. Crispy crunch? Yeah. I like crispy crunch. I like the flakiness of it. My mom always liked score, but score was too hard for me. Um, Those are in the U.S. The Maynards. So Maynards uh, are Sour great. Patch Kids are very well known in the U.S. Right? Really? Yes. Are they? Yes. I love fuzzy. Peaches. I see them on YouTube channels all the time. Oh, I'm looking forward to this. Oh, it's gonna be a good. <laughs> we have some upstairs already. We can start on those. I know. Next I have to, show. Have to get some. I do like British chocolate because growing up, I have a lot of British relatives, mm. and they'd send me the chocolate bar assortments, like the full big chocolate bar assortments at Christmas. These are um, American Smarties. So I love a good... Um, we are, they're called Rockets here, American Smarties. Yeah, we call them Rockets. It's the same thing as Because we already American had a Smarties. Smarties. Uh, Mom and Joy, disgusting. Oh, yeah. Skittles. I love Skittles. Are good. I overdosed. Did for, you? Yeah. For a while there. Your Get away from the courts. Fun fact. Yeah. When I, when I became vegan, Skittles I couldn't eat. Then, mm. the first pst, kitten, the first country to make vegan Skittles were Australia. And I imported a huge box of Skittles from Australia. Yeah. Um, yeah. 
And that's when I overdosed on Skittles. You ate a lot of Skittles. That's all. Yeah. Oh, I like those. Oh, the fizz candies? Those I'm not Canadian? a fan of those. Wow. I don't know. So are Canadian. Well, they're maybe, I don't know. They're people. like Pop Rocks. But they're in a, in a candy? Stop listening. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Um, yeah. <laughs> um, coffee crisp, though. If you are an American or you're in another country oh and you've never had a coffee God. crisp, they so are good. so good. They're they're not strong flavored, but they nope. are coffee flavored. Hint of coffee. And they have that bubbly arrow bar texture in the middle um, between wafers. And they are just fantastic. And they're very, very light and tr- sweet. Those are, I hate That's those. That's trash. I hate the cherry blossoms. Trash too. candy. Nobody no. buys them and somehow they're still around. Yeah. <laughs> Look at that. $38 for 24 pounds. We have Waste some, of money. We, have some <laughs> we get coffee crisp in the US. Okay. For some reason, I didn't think you got coffee crisp. Oh, even more trash? Oh, this yeah. is the most trash candy ever. It's not. It's not candy. It's the worst. It's a joke. Look, it's not. A, it's not really no, a joke. It is a joke. Yeah, curly whirlies. That's caramel, right? That's caramel. Um, like I remember inter- having curly whirlies. They're like interlocking. Yeah. Like, this um, this is gum. It's Canadian, and it says it still tastes like soap. Yeah, it's lavender flavored gum. <laughs> It's Ugh. a joke. <laughs> it's not. It wasn't advertised no, as a joke, joke in the 80s. But some people love it. It's crazy. Yeah. Crunchy versus Violet Crumble. Oh, oh so I guess there's a discussion. Better ch- oh. Has better honeycomb, but Crunchy has better chocolate. Oh, okay. Oh. They seem very similar. Those are awesome. Sour Those juice. are good. <laughs> We're just going to talk about candy. Uh, that is incorrect. <laughs> what the, is incorrect? What is incorrect? The whirly, curly whirly? Oh, crunchy wins all around. Oh, okay. crunchy fan. I do like crunchy. These are kind of gum. Oh, I love them. Kind they're of gum. Candy? But they're very bad. They're very. You eat them and you chew them like gum, but then they dry out really fast yeah. and you almost like. They're weird. You almost eat them, like swallow them. Yeah. But they're sour. They're really good. I really like them. Anything, anything made by Maynard's is Maynard's so good. Maynard's is always good. Yeah. yeah. Uh, anything else in here? It's good stuff. It's how it shatters that matters. Are you talking about the crunchy? <laughs> oh, I used to eat a lot of the... Big Turk, someone mentioned. Blah, no. Car- I think they do sell them, though. Caramel. Blocks of caramel. Um, so, oh! Craft. The craft caramels. Not caramel. No, craft caramels. They were craft. Okay, yeah. Craft. Yep. Swear. I swear they're and they only they only come out at uh, Halloween. I don't know if they still make. No, them. not those. Nothing of those. Not the square ones. No. The ones that pull out your fillings. Yes, the ones that pull out your fillings. Oh, uh, the hard one. Hard. Hard caramel. Yeah. Where? What do is they it? call it? Like Scotch something? Oh, yeah. yeah Scotch yeah. something. Well, they were in a Scotch. Yeah. Tim Tams are good. I mean, they're kind of cookies, oh, chocolate covered cookies, that. but also penguins. I, I used to get penguins from some of my relatives too. Yeah, it's not on here. No, what is it like? Scotch, scotch toffee, toffee. Oh, they're called toffee. Toffee. It's scotch toffee, I swear. I think I have to put take out, bar. no, take caramel out. It's not caramel. It's oh. Macintosh. Macintosh. That's why I thought scotch. Macintosh. Ah, yeah, ah, yeah. Okay. Well, that, that is not what I remember. No, but now we have the name. We can actually look it up. I said change it. Looks like. I don't know. It was in squares. It broke yeah, apart in there, squares. There. Yeah. But it would look different before. Um. Anyway, you would keep it in the wrapper. You'd smash <laughs> it on the ground. Oh yeah. You'd free, you'd you put freeze it, in the, freeze it, it, smash it, smash it, so you could eat the bits because otherwise your teeth would, would come. Well, out. it would pull your. Okay, stop right now. Out. The shops are still <laughs> open here. Sorry. Well, I've, we've already bought our Maynard's candy for Halloween. Oh. I always like to have some, even though no one comes to our door. They can't we gotta find have it. some, and then we eat them all. Why do you get paper sticks? Oh, no, sticks? That's another one that I think people eat it and they're like, meh, but they're just, they're basically thin strip potato chips. They're really thin, and you just grab them by the handful and stuff them in the Good times. Good times. Good times. Maple candy, it's so sweet. I can't eat it. I, I don't... I like, don't. it has to be, like, super tiny because it's Not so Not like hard sweet. candy. I like the maple sugar candies that you buy from, like, an actual... an app. Um, 
No, they're white. They're like white, oh. and they're maple sugar, and they're formed into candies. Oh. Those are real, real maple sugar candies. Those are really good. Canadians don't really eat this stuff. It's too. Like, I you never see anybody eating maple candies. I put maple syrup on my pancakes. No, you don't. I do. You I put. put butter. I, no, I put a little bit. Uh, Cyrano doesn't want to hear it. La la la, <laughs> not this name. Charleston Chew. Charleston Chew. Never had one. I haven't either, actually. I, I think that's an American thing. Char no, no, I don't think so. I don't think I've ever seen a Charleston Chew in Canada. Oh. Never, ever, 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 ever. And then like There's chocolate bars that don't come to Canada. Mars bars and great Three Musketeers are nope. different in Canada than the states sometimes. What moment? What? What are you talking about? Stop Stop going on about vomit. Butyric acid. This is why American chocolate bars don't come into Canada or anywhere else in the world. Yeah. The perception that American chocolate tastes like sick <laughs> can be attributed to the per presence of butyric acid oh. in some American chocolate recipes. I think I think Hershey's is the one that has the strongest butyric of that flavor. Butyric acid is a compound found in milk products and is also present in rancid butter Let's and vomit. Stop it. No, See, it's Cyrano, so he's, he's trying to turn you off. <laughs> yeah, stale artificial cheese. It's it's the butyric... Stink. Butyric acid. It literally... I, you know why? I don't was, like it. The history is it was put in there to, so it would keep yes. well for the US, for the war. For the war rations. And they would give it to American soldiers. Yeah. And then they got used to it. Yeah, and people are used <laughs> to like, eating mm, it. vomit candy. I don't think it's that bad, but I don't oh, it's bad. prefer it. I wouldn't, I'd, I'd rather have other chocolate Ugh, a lot of the time. Acid. Um, it's okay if it's in candy, but like actual chocolate. There you go. Yeah. The fallout of World War II and Hershey changing, changing their, their formula. formula. Yeah. Why does American chocolate <laughs> taste, taste bad? bad? Oh, funny. Oh. Poor, um, poor America. But then, if you're used to it, and that's what you like, it becomes nostalgic. I think. Yep. yep. But um, anyway, I'm not knocking American chocolate. I mean, I, uh, their candies are good. I just don't yes, like the chocolate on its own. Um, it really isn't okay. Poor <laughs> Americans, all. Oh, also, I'm people of certain nice. age in Europe love it because the first chocolate Europeans had for almost a decade from the Giannis. Oh, oh so they have a nostalgia. So there's for a nostalgia. It. That mean, makes sense. I mean, it does. For, seven year olds and 80 year olds yeah. the thing that we froze and shattered we think is macintosh toffee oh, we don't think it is i think it's macintosh, it's macintosh. Yeah. yeah i haven't had that in a long time I, I, I remember getting it too like who bought it for me yeah anyway it will take the fillings out of your mouth not a candy bar it was the actual toffee oh back in back what uh well, I guess it went away. So, yeah. And out of stock. Out of stock. There you go. So, it's still not. Products, available. products. Oh, that's it. Yeah, so maybe they did disappear. Yeah. I think it was anyway. It is. It was. Yeah. I know. Pulls that. the fillings out of me. That's why you smashed it. Too. Okay. Um, so, yeah, we played Last Strike. We did not come anywhere near the top score, which I didn't think, because mm -hmm. there's some good players. And we tried our best. I did I did better than I ever have done, so I was very happy with my score in the last strike. So there's no show on Tuesday, even though we're still here, um, because we're prepping for PRGE, because we're taking off down the West Coast to Portland. Cats are going in cat jail. They're very excited about it. You're going to the vet? Yeah, you don't even know what's happening. Um, but then we're doing live broadcasts from PRGE Friday, Saturday, Sunday, mm -hmm. showing you everything that's there, showing you all the tables. So even if you can't come, you can get a little taste. Yeah, you can participate. Yeah, a little and, taste uh, of We'll Portland. be watching the chat yeah. and uh, be going around interviewing devs, yeah. uh, showing off all the new homebrew games that are available, going around the showroom floor. Oh, I got it. I got it. You got it? Bye bye. <laughs> and a bow. Oh, I want uh, chocolate now. <laughs> uh, you have chocolate upstairs. What? Yes. Hold on. Chocolate's half open. Oh, that's cool. Milk chocolate. Oh, you need to throw it away then. Yeah, it's going to get um, Yeah, we'll be uh, broadcasting at least a couple hours every day. Mm -hmm. um, because I don't need to buy anything. Um, there's a couple things. They're not going to be there. No. I need to buy PAL C64. Hmm. Um, yeah. What else? I gotta switch away so I can see what else I I want to get. Um, what are my wants? Where are my wants? Where's my PRG? There it is. Oh my goodness. 
Um, a Atari video music. I've never seen that at PRG. Mm-hmm. A heavy sixer in a chess piece box. Good luck with that, too. Not going to find that. Yeah. Um, and I don't really care about that. So there yeah. are things that are expensive, super hard to find, and I've never seen them at PRG. So uh, are they going to be there this year? No, they're not. Serena says the best chocolate I've ever tasted is made by monks who live off on an island off oh, the wow. south coast of Wales. Look up Isle of Caldy and chocolate. I have some Welsh relatives. I might have to ask them to send me some. The Isle of Caldy. Isle of Caldy shop. Yeah. Caldy Island online shop. Isle of Caldy chocolate. It's in a gold. Ooh. Ooh gold, yeah. Finest handmade Welsh chocolate. Oh. Okay, £3.50. That'll be good. Well, you get both of them or one? <laughs> dark, have dark chocolate. Dark chocolate. Ooh. Yeah. See ingredients. Oh, Mystery nice. ingredients. Very nice. FAQ. No. Mystery ingredients. Who knows what's in this really, really good chocolate? Uh, the chocolate needs savoring and only shared with special <laughs> friends. Oh, okay. Nice. Well, people Call like the that. Island. Very nice. Okay, well, next time we're in Wales. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, then on the first, no show. We have to recover from PRG. Mm. Uh, that's a lot of work, a lot of thinking, constant thinking. Mm. Uh, the brain needs to go dead for a little while. After. Yeah. So the first show, we're back October 4th. I think there's some games. I'm starting to line up some, Already? some okay. games. I think I've got a 2600 game I've, I can play. So we'll Show see. off anything we, we get. Well, yeah, yeah, there's that too. Um, so I'll bring back a bunch of games. And there's a... I'll probably play ones I haven't played. Yes. Because yeah, there are a sense. couple yeah. that I haven't played. There's one I, haven't, I still don't know any information about. I only have the name of it. Really? Yeah, so I'll probably play that one. Um, and then, oh, I need to put this in place still. Uh, that is on the 11th. We're going to be uh, showing off the new secret homebrew. Won't be secret by then from Champ Games. Yay. And also playing Tutankham Arcade Retail and yes. interview with John Champo. Oh, my goodness. I mean, we'll be talking to him at PRG as yes. well. But we'll have them all to ourselves Yay. on the stream on the 11th. <laughs> We're also going to be to playing Tony retail version. It's been updated and fixed because we found a bug mm. in it. And they fixed that bug after I reported it to them. We've got the Vectrex special. The uh, second Vectrex game should be arriving by then. Excellent. I'm looking forward to that. That's going to be yes. fun. Uh, we're going to play, be talking with Albert Yeruso, hopefully in October, right after PRG, so we can get a rundown of what he thought of that. Uh, yeah, that'll be fun. Fuji Net Online Gaming. So there's a bunch of online games we can play with other people. Oh, I'm yeah. getting thin. Why are you oh, biting he's me? like, give me they food. They want more treats, that's fine. Yeah. Oh, and in November, we're going to be playing Bounty Bob Strikes Back, the first 7800 game released by Atari in mm -hmm. 33 mm -hmm. years. And a live interview with Bob DeCrescenzo. Mm -hmm. It is good. I did the beta testing for it. So, no, there's no bugs. <laughs> I found them. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> um, a bunch of other fun stuff that we're going to be doing. So, thanks for hanging out with us uh, while we played uh, Cyrano's awesome fun game, so Last Strike good. DX. I feel it's like so good. there's probably so much more to see that we never get to. Because it's a pretty yeah. hard game, but we'll have to keep working so on it. I made it. it to... Three. Almost. The first part of the third level. Yes. Third world. Are there four worlds, It Cyrano? showed four. Okay. Uh, in the selection. So we still have a ways to go to get yeah. to the end of that game. I say we. <sighs> yeah. I mean him. <laughs> <laughs> Could that's, I make it? I game. think with enough practice, I was getting better and better. Yeah, you... Yeah. I find yeah. it's the kind of game that you... Five. Okay. Yeah. Five. Excellent. So Oof. we're really far from the end. <laughs> Very far from the end. Still. Well, thank you for making the game, yeah. and thank you for updating the game to make it even better than before. Um, so that's it for us until PRG. So next time you'll see us uh, when we wander around the showroom floor. Uh, I don't know when. 
we're going to be broadcasting so definitely follow the stream mm -hmm. and to be able to know when it happens you have to kind of have twitch on your phone mm -hmm. and allow it to pop up and say blah is streaming um, and it'll show you streams that you're following and it'll pop up on your phone so mm -hmm. that's the best way um, I might I've, I'll try and put in times when we're streaming and give like warnings watch it he's in a mood hey booty cat and uh, yeah but just keep watching it'll be Friday Saturday Sunday two-ish around that time mm -hmm. it'll definitely be after lunch do you really seriously sir 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 enough of that sir um so thanks for hanging out yeah. with us mr lou cyrano reboot gamma dev jg polly gox who else who else Kiss. johnny the whiz kid you need to be crated <laughs> <laughs> don't have a crate but no um <laughs> can still threaten them uh the raid from serrano yeah. thank you so much it's kev and serrano themselves uh danny vc cafe man, man 2D and charles, charles Wieland. Wieland. thank you so much for hanging out oh miss lou is the jas musician awesome you did an awesome job yeah and pro seven can't wait to play it and pro seven can't wait to play it on the show mm -hmm. it'll be awesome so uh, we're out of here till PRGE. Yep. Keep have watching week. the skies. Yeah. Um, yeah. Have a great week and, and we'll have a great soon. weekend. And we'll see you at PRGE mm -hmm. if you are there. If you're not, we'll see you on the stream. Yes. Uh, bye, bye bye. Have a great week. Bye bye.